Hey what's up guys it's Aptrix here finally welcome to the setup video of WinLater Android on an Mali GPU device so right here i have my Redmi K50i with MediaTek processor and in today's video we'll be finding out how easy it is to set up WinLater on an Mali GPU Android device so this setup will work on devices with Exynos MediaTek or Kirin processors with that being said let's get started so for today's video we'll be using the WinLater 6.1 update which is the latest version of WinLater and its minimum requirements are Android version 10 or above along Along with 4 GB of RAM. So I have already added the WinLater 6.1 on my Android device. As you know WinLater is an open source Windows emulator for Android. When you open it for the first time you will need to wait until it has been initialized on your Android devices. So just tap on the allow button and wait for few minutes. Alright guys once it has been initialized we will need to make some changes with the settings so it supports Mali GPU Android devices. By the way here is the spec of my Android device. It has MediaTek Dimensity 8100 processor and 6 GB of RAM out of which available RAM is only 1.5 GB only 28% of the RAM is available even though there are no apps in background so that is very poor from Xiaomi side nonetheless let's just go ahead and open settings you can choose the box 64 and box 86 preset as performance depending on the game which you want to test out but make sure that the box 86 version which you are using is 0.3.5 and box 64 is 0.2.7 Afterwards just go ahead and tap on the tick mark option then we'll just go ahead and tap on the plus button and create a brand new container. For this uh, in terms of screen size we'll go with 1280 by 720p 16 is to 9 aspect ratio and here comes the most important setting. In terms of graphics driver you'll have to go with Virgil. By default it will be selected to Turnip Adreno but as our device has Mali GPU only Virgil will be working and in terms of DX wrapper Wine D3D will be our default option you'll have to make sure to set this DX wrapper or else it will not work. With the help of Mesa Virgil and Wine Day 3D you can only emulate games which are up to DirectX version 9. But in terms of audio driver make sure to choose the Pulse Audio option and enable the Show FPS option. Once that has been done make sure to disable the CPU 0, 1, 2 and 3 uh, from the processor affinity. Afterwards scroll down make sure to uh, keep the GPU as default and in terms of video memory size you can set it to 2GB as already we have seen the RAM which is available on this Android device is very very low. Let's head on over towards the advanced settings where we have selected the box 86 and box 64 preset as performance and in terms of win components make sure that the direct sound option is set to native windows. So guys that's going to be the container settings for uh, win later android and I'll be showing you guys some additional settings once we open the emulator. So once everything has been set up just go ahead and tap on the tick mark option and let win later create a new container. Once the container has been created just tap on these three lines and then tap on the run button and now it will start up our brand new wine container and when you are starting this up for the first time it will take some time so just be patient don't click off thinking that your device is not supported as i mentioned before minimum requirements wise this device is good to go android 10 or above and 6 gb of ram is all that's needed and there we go guys win later is successfully working on an mali gpu android device as you might be able to see which is pretty amazing but first of all we'll just go ahead and head on over to the start section and let me zoom my camera so you guys can see it a bit better. Alright guys make sure to head on over towards the system tools option and then go to wine configuration. This is very important we will need to check if the windows version is set to windows 7. Uh, uh, in this case uh, it has been set to windows 7 so we will just go ahead and tap on the ok button and that's basically going to be the complete setup of win later on a Mali GPU android device. Just go ahead and toggle full screen more. Let me know in the comment section down below if you guys want me to test out some games on my Mali GPU android device. Anyways guys that's going to be it for today's video be sure to hit that like button subscribe turn on all notifications as i bring similar videos on my channel thanks for watching goodbye